In this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way to make a video for your podcast uh, that's ready to upload to YouTube. So the way that you might initially think that you need to do this is to take an image file and your audio file and open up a movie editor like iMovie um, or something else and create the video that way. Um, that takes a very long time. You also end up with a very large video file. Um, the way that I'm going to show you is just going to take um, maybe a couple seconds and then it'll process the video uh, in less than five minutes. So what you're going to want to do first is install Homebrew. Um, you can do that by opening up your ter terminal by hitting command space and just typing in terminal and you'll get a screen that looks something like this. Uh, yours may be white um, this is a little bit different. Um, you'll then copy and paste this into the terminal and you will hit enter and it'll install homebrew. Um, I already have it installed so I'm not going to do that. Um, you could also go to brew.sh uh, and you can uh, learn more about what homebrew does but essentially all that does is allow you to install other software. Uh, next, what you're going to do is install FFmpeg uh, using Homebrew. You're going to do that with this brew install FFmpeg line. Um, similarly, you'll just paste it in your command line and you'll hit enter and install it. Um, again, I already have it installed, so I'm not going to do that. Um, once you have it installed, um, all you'll need is an audio file. So this is my audio file. Podcasting is like painting. And then this is my background that I want the video to be. Um, it's just going to be this single file um, image for the entire video. You'll then take this line of code here, and you'll paste and you'll paste it in your um, command line. And I'll show you that in just a second. Um, but first, what you're going to want to do is update a few variables in here. So this right here, you're going to want to change to whatever the name of the image uh, that you want to be the background. Preferably the image would already be the size of a video that you want it to be, uh, which would be 16 by 9. Um, the video, the image that I have here is 1920 by 1080. Um, so if you have a, an image that size, that should work just fine. This second piece here, the 003.mp3, uh, that's going to be the name of the audio file that you want. So I'm going to use this audio file here, episode 22 of my podcast, Thinkularity. And I'm going to put that right there. The last thing you want to change is the output file name. So we're going to end up with a video that's a .mkv file. And we want to name that um, 022 also. Um, I've already done this, so we'll name it. Um, well, we'll just add another 2 to it. Um, now that we've updated this with our image that we want to use, the vi audio file that we want to use, and the name of the output that we want, um, we'll copy that. Um, next, what you're going to want to do is navigate to where your video, where your audio file and your image is. Um, so these are my images here, and you can see that it is in a folder that I created. Um, to do this, you'll just need to know two commands. Um, so you can hit ls, enter, and it'll show you all of the paths, all the folders that you can open. Um, so this is the root of my file system. Um, the one that I want to go to is in this Thinkularity folder. So I'll do cd, uh, that just means change directory, and I'll type in Thinkularity. Since that is the name of the folder, um, that is the name of my podcast. Um, that'll open up that folder and as you can see inside that folder I hit LS and enter that shows me that there's another folder in there called YouTube um, so then I'll hit change directory and type in the name of the folder YouTube and now I am in that folder so if you see here you'll be able to see my um, my audio file and my video file or sorry and my image file next I'm going to copy the code here and I'll just paste it here and it'll run the program and what it's going to do is create this video here so this is 0222.mkv this is this video right here and finally what you'll end up with is a video that looks like this 
So this is that image that I showed uh, and using the audio. I feel like there could be audio editing software specific. So this file here, this video is a, over an hour long. And as you can see, it's a very small file, only 82 megabytes. Um, if you were to do this in something like iMovie, that would be much larger and this process would take a much longer time. Um, so this is a very fast way. I made maybe 20 videos the other day in uh, less than an, an hour. Um, so yeah, this is the best way to do this. And this file here is um, ready to upload to YouTube. Um, so you can put your podcast on your YouTube channel uh, very easily. And that's all. So thank you for watching. Um, I hope you learned something. If you have any questions about anything, you can either leave a comment or you could reach out to me um, at ThinkUlarity on Twitter. Uh, and then if you want to support us, please download and subscribe to our podcast, uh, ThinkUlarity, wherever podcasts are found. Thank you and bye.